Hey there guys, this is Rocky Red Panda, you already know, PND Studios. Now over the past few days, you've probably seen the latest thing in the news, the sad news. The oldest ruling monarch of England, Queen Elizabeth II, has passed away at 96. Now, yes, I am from America, and the most common question I get is like, but you're American, you're not British, so why are you mourning her loss? And also, colonialism. <clears throat> That's a dirty word we don't talk about, colonialism. So we're not going to talk about colonialism in this video. Um, we're going to keep it non-political. But I'll answer for the simple fact, why am I mourning the loss of the Queen as me being American? Well, this goes back to my grandmother, and it goes back to my family roots. I am actually part Scottish. That's right, I got my Scottish roots um, in my family. That goes back to many generations on my mother's side with my grandmother and my grandfather. I got Henderson and Anderson clan. Um, they're from Dundee and Arbroath, Scotland. Yeah. And my mother would tell me stories um, growing up that uh, she had um, aunts or uncles, my grandfather's cousins, who actually lived, still lived in uh, Scotland, and they spoke only Gaelic, <laughs> which is now kind of like a dying art, but they spoke very, very, very Gaelic. <laughs> so I have my proud Scottish roots in my family. Also, six generations of the Black Watch. So <laughs> we had that too. But, um, for my, that's part of the reason why I mourn the loss of the Queen. But the second is a little artifact that is sitting right above the television on a shelf in the living room. Now that is a little wooden cutout or a little wooden sculpture of the royal carriage. Now that, from what my mother tells me, was from the 50s when the Queen's coronation happened. And the banks over in Canada were giving these out for free um, to its um, members during the Queen's coronation to celebrate God Save the Queen. You know, the coronation of Queen Elizabeth II. <laughs> so, you know, we had that and it kind of brings a lot to me. And when I look at it, I smile. That belonged to my grandmother. But there's just so much more I can talk about family history, and all that stuff kind of piling in together of while I'm mourning the loss of the Queen. Now, here at PND Studios, you know, the loss of the Queen is sad. But we move on because they have a new king. God save the king! Uh, king Charles III. Now, we do wish him all the best as a success and all the best with his family. So we'll see how King Charles does as the new King of England. King Charles III. I gotta be politically correct here. King Charles III. But my memories of the Queen, she was the only Queen that I knew growing up. I can tell you one that sticks with me. It was 2000 it was 1997. We were having a yard sale in the front of our house. And I remember this day so vividly. We were selling things, but uh, I got called into the house because the, it was the funeral service for Princess Diana. And I remember that Elton John saying uh, goodbye. Da 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 You know, and the whole pageantry that was on television. I remember my mother saying, please record that. You know, I was young, but I was young enough to know what happened and what was going on. She was the people's princess, and everyone loved Diana just as much as I love the Queen of England. 
because she was the only queen that I knew. I grew up with her. And there will never be a queen like her, but we keep the memories alive. Because the one thing in our family is that we all joked about is she looked just like my grandmother. Um, <laughs> yeah, she did just look like my grandmother. But that's a story for another time. But we do mourn the loss of Queen Elizabeth II here at PND Studios. And I'll be joining all the other people around the world for the next few days uh, leading up into the Queen's final um, farewell ceremony at uh, Westminster Abbey in mourning her loss. Let's take another brief moment of silence. But make sure you like and subscribe. Like and subscribe to my channel for more awesome videos. Now, I would like to know your comments and your memories of the Queen herself. You can leave it down below. But for now, this is Rocky Red Panda signing out. Until next time, I'm going to use a new phrase just for this video. God save the king! Ta-ta.